so we will um, remember we've created a table called aliens and we have did um, ID name shape color arms eyes and mouth and ears for the fields now we're going to create another table we just um, create another t table that has an one extra field called image okay so we will just go into the database and then in the database we can create a new table so we'll just call it aliens with double l this time and we can say image because we want to add an image to it and the numbers the number of fields this time is eight because last time we were sorry uh, this time will be nine and we will go go and that's give us the table in here so it's again the first one is id and it was integer before and we say it is auto increment and we talked about the index and we said it's a primary the next one is name and we'll say var char we're gonna give it a length next one is color so i'm just using exactly the same field as before shape next one is um arms mouth and eyes and ears and remember the ears will be it's a boolean and we said there was a default and the default is zero and the next one is image so um the next field is the image and if we go to the image, the type in here, we're going to choose it as B, L, O, B. That's for the image. And you want the default. Just, so the default is not null or just I've defined it. It's up to you or it could be um, null is the default. So it doesn't really matter in this case. So after you've chosen everything, you go save. And there is an error. Um, sorry, so I think here we should say none. We'll just try that. Yep, that's successful. So for the image, you just say none. So it's the same as the previous defaults. And now we've created our new table with have as image field. Now we've got this table as we said, we've just created with image field. Now I'll show you how to insert data into this table using PHP my admin, and then we will go to um, use PHP website to insert data. So we're just going to insert one. Um, so we will come here. The ID, as we said, we're not going to put anything in the ID because we said it's an auto increment and this is a key. Name, we will um, just enter first one, Bob, I think. It was let's say it was blue I didn't really look into it's rectangle arms had two I think so as far as I remember for the aliens another two in here eyes two sorry the mouth was open eyes are two we had an ear and then you can see here that says choose file, right? So you go here, you will choose the file wherever you save them. So I've saved them on Google Drive. So that's Bob. So Bob was green, sorry. I... Let's change it to green. And then when you say so 
so one rose as is correctly now if i go to browse i should see bob has been added and you can see that's the size of the image now storing images into a database that's not very practical because they do take a lot of space but at this moment we're just learning and the database that we're going to use is quite small so we're going to learn how to insert a data into the database using our php and then how to retrieve the data from the database using php